On the night of July 3, 1954, Dr. Sam Shepard and his wife Marilyn hosted a gathering of neighbors at their lakeside home. Shepard dozed off on the daybed in the living room. Meanwhile, Marilyn saw the guests out. At 5.40 a.m. on July 4, Marilyn was found bludgeoned to death in her bed. Shepard called a neighbor for help and upon arriving, they found Shepard shirtless with a bloodstain on his pants. Appearing disoriented, he stated that he was asleep when he heard his wife's screams and quickly ran upstairs to encounter a man with bushy hair who was assaulted him and rendered him unconscious. Despite his story, the police found the scene suspicious and arrested him. He was eventually tried, found guilty and sentenced to life in prison. The trial was controversial and criticized as a carnivalesque affair. However, in 1964, his conviction was overturned due to the unfairness of the trial. Although DNA evidence found later implicated another suspect who had been doing repairs on the Shepard home, while some still believe that Dr. Shepard was guilty.